I will not be responsible. Mod at your own risk. Hey guys, it's me here, and today what we're doing is we're going to be installing an add-on vehicle. Now the add-on vehicle that we are going to be installing is this police supercar add-on pack. So as you can see, these are some pretty nice cars. Uh, they are not ELS, sadly, but um, they are some very nice cars, and let's get them installed. So, first off, open Open IV and download that pack. Once you've downloaded that pack, you should see something like this. And then, once you have downloaded it and you have something like this, then what you need to do is go to Mods. Update, X64, DLC packs, and then you just drag this into here. Make sure OpenIV is on, click yes, and just drag that in there. And when that is finished, just make sure it's in there. It's in there as you can see. Now, once that's in, you go to mods, update, update RPF common data then what you need to do is go down to dlc list.xml you have to right click and click edit now if you right click and nothing comes up with edit like this then make sure you have edit mode on right click and click edit and scroll down to the bottom copy the bottom one and paste it below like that what you're going to do is get rid of the uh, the text where it is in between these slashes and you're going to type in the name of the folder that you just put in so it'd be bizzle police as you can see it's here it says bizzle police and then once you've done that just click save and you are done one when you've done that, what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to install some files that um, that will make sure your game will not crash once you have installed them. I will be linking all of these down in the description. Um, I'll also show you guys how to install them right now as this is needed. So, be, it, so you'd have to install a heap adjuster. I click download, download now. Once that is downloaded, just open it. You'll get these two files. Drag and drop these files into your GTA 5 main directory, just like that. Once you have done that, click out. And then you're going to be going to the second link that is in the description, which will be the pack pack file limit adjuster and you click on download download now with your gta5 main directory you've opened it and you're just going to drag and drop these into your gta5 main directory as well and read the readme and it will tell you how to install them right there and that is it for the game so i will see you guys in the game with these cars oh, please. now wait till oh, we are going to mods update x64 dlc packs go to bizzle police dlc to rpf x64 if you go to vehicles to rpf here will be the names that you guys will be able to use to spawn these in so audi pd let's try that so go into the game, up spawn, Audi, Audi, P, Audi, P, D, like that. And now if you just wait a minute, the first time that the car spawns in, it will take a couple of minutes for it to actually spawn in as it's a new car that you guys have just added. If your game does freeze like this, then all you got to do is just wait. It will do this the first time. Oh yeah. And then just press F4 and you will unfreeze. Okay, right. So as you guys can see, it has worked. Here is the car. 
here as you guys can see it has worked remember guys to like subscribe and uh, more, tut more tutorials will be coming out soon on how to do stuff like how to get rid of all this glitching that you guys can see on the ground uh, and all this texture loss that be a 100% next video and then we're doing videos on how to um, release well how to add replace cars hey guys if you like this video remember to like subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next tutorial peace hey guys i would just like to say that i did forget to you guys to download game config you can find it in the description below uh, there will be a readme on how to install it i'll also type some instructions uh, description below on how to install it i hope you guys have a great day remember to like subscribe